A crime alert tonight from one of the, most, uh, the city's most popular areas. Crime scene tape and dozens of officers working what's now the city's latest homicide. This is in the Central West End, not far the, from the Cathedral Basilica. A man was carjacked, then run over with his own car near Maryland and Boyle. News 4's Jenna Ray on this story for us tonight. Jenna, you're also finding other problems in that area that may not be on everyone's radar. That's exactly right, and you rarely hear of carjackings, let alone a murder here in the Central West End. But recently, I've actually seen some chatter on next door where area residents say they're noticing that growth in crime. One woman telling me that she's constantly looking over her shoulder. It seemed to have happened near the victim's own back door. In the middle of the day, St. Louis police say a man had his car stolen right in front of him. The suspect, when driving off, sources say hit and killed the victim. Minutes later, police blocking off the driveway. The victim's shoes remained untouched. I was upset to hear it and a little shocked. Not so too shocked, though, which is annoying that it has to be that way, that you're not even shocked when something happens anymore. Lindsay Fafoglia has lived in the Central West End for a few years now. We've never felt unsafe here. Foglia says she and her boyfriend moved to the area because of its safer reputation. But she also says she knows crime can happen anywhere and her head is always on a swivel. There are so many car related incidents that I just feel like I'm always on edge. When I leave my car, I have like I know I lock the doors as soon as I get in it. I get out, I have my keys in hand. I'm always checking my surroundings. I'm just always prepared for it to happen. News 4 finding in the Central West End motor thefts are up 50% from last year. Police data shows in August alone there were 50 car thefts. And neighbors on next door are feeling the wrath of that as well. Several of them in the last few weeks commenting on their own car theft experiences. Many having catalytic converters stolen. You should always lock your doors, lock your car, always look behind you, make sure if you see anything, you know, contact police or authority um, and, and don't let suspicious behavior just kind of go by the wayside. Right now, we know that St. Louis police do have that carjacking suspect in custody. He was found in North City just hours after that crime. For now, we're still working to get his name and what charges St. Louis police are seeking. We're live in the Central West End tonight. Jenna Ray, News 4.